we made it. It's 2021. Welcome back. On this episode, this first episode of 2021, we are going to take a look at one of 2020's leftovers, Ma Rainey's Black Bottom with Viola Davis and the late Chadwick Boseman. That and our usual business on this episode of The Monitors. August Wilson was a prolific 20th century playwright. He has given us many rich and powerful stories about the black experience throughout the 20th century. His literary voice was honest and unapologetic. He wrote characters that he knew, which meant that we knew those characters as well, and that made them real. The latest adaptation of an August Wilson play to make it to the screen is Ma Rainey's Black Bottom, which saw a limited theatrical release and also was dropped on Netflix back on December 18th. This Denzel Washington production was written by Ruben Santiago Hudson and directed by George Wolfe. It stars Viola Davis in the title role of Ma and co-stars Glenn Turman, Coleman Domingo, Michael Potts, and the late Chadwick Boseman, among others. The story centers on Ma Rainey and her entourage, journeying from her home in the South where she is mother of the blues and traveling to Chicago to make a record. As the day unfolds, we observe the struggle of power Ma, aware that her day is fading, maneuvers to maintain absolute control of her music and her band, ultimately her legacy. She must keep her white manager in line and contend with her lead trumpet player, one young Levy Green, played by Bozeman, whose ambitions are perceived by Ma as a threat. Levy also has his own demons that fuel his drive and ultimately contribute to the story's dark conclusion. This movie has that familiar dynamic of feeling like a stage play that's filmed with its static set pieces and heavily dialogue-driven scenes. But director George Wolfe finds the opportunities to make the most of the medium. For example, there's an opening number that immerses us into the blues of Ma Rainey. 100 extras are all meticulously dressed in period clothing and Viola Davis and cast while obviously lip-syncing and miming playing instruments are exuding the energy of this performance. This set piece sets the tone for the film for the scenes and dialogue that follow. Hudson's screenplay is a faithful adaptation of Wilson's work, and Wolf's direction of the performances isn't heavy-handed. Since he has masters of their craft in the cast, he can mostly just get out of their way. There are many extremely capable actors who could have played Ma Rainey, but I cannot imagine anyone who would have done what Viola Davis has with the role. Davis inhabits every inch of Ma, and her performance is nothing short of masterful. Bozeman is equally powerful as Levy. It's a role that cannot be played by just any actor. Levy, like all of Wilson's characters, are multi-layered. Bozeman opens Levy up completely and his performance pleads his case. Whether you like him or not, you understand Levy, he's a tragic figure. Also tragic is Bozeman's passing last year, which makes this one of his last performances, if not his very last. Coleman Domingo, Glenn Turman, and Michael Potts are all strong in their supporting roles as Cutler, Toledo, and Slow Drag as are Taylor Page and Dusan Brown. Jeremy Shamos is also very good as Mr. Irvin as he tries to manage Ma's expectations and Johnny Coyne's Sturdivant, the record producer. Ma Rainey's Black Bottom is a complete success as a film stage production. It feels like an August Wilson film, powerful, masterful performances, and a story set nearly a century ago that tells the story of a real black woman who was master of her destiny as a businesswoman and an artist. See it.
interesting stuff. So, have you seen Ma Rainey's Black Bottom? What did you think? If you have an opinion, like it or hate it, please leave it below. Also, give us a like if you would, and also click that subscribe button and click the bell so you can be notified about new content. And that's going to do it for this episode. We'll see you next time. Take care. Be good to yourselves. Be good to each other. Peace, and we are out. God bless.